Here's this guy playing guitar with nothing but his mouth. That's it. The strangest, most beautiful sound that I've ever heard. I mean, people had not seen anything like that. I wanted to do something different, both literally, figuratively, spiritually, and creatively. Black people loved it. White people loved it. Native Americans said he was what they envisioned if Hiawatha and Sacagawea had a baby, so... Can you talk about your relationship with Jimi Hendrix growing up? Every time I do one of these interviews, it's like all they want to talk about is Jimmy, 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 Jimmy. It was always about Hendrix. Yes, Donnell and I were friends. Jimmy asked me to go to London with him. Turn their robbery into something bigger than it already was. I mean, it wasn't until later that I found out that Donnell really had feelings for me. Darnell was just heartbroken. You know, that's when things started really get dark for dark. All hell broke loose. Shit got really dangerous. Which I guess is bound to happen when you got a live alligator on your tour bus. You stole an alligator. I was mentally exhausted. It was the drugs. Cocaine. Turkish hash. So much speed. Check Bam Bam. PCP. Mushrooms. Elephant tranquilizers. They all took like a handful of peyote buttons. And I saw them wandering off into the desert with a rocket launcher. He could do that with his mouth. What else could he do with his mouth?